Hi, I'm Gigi, and I want to welcome you to Gigi's Magic Mailbox. We're going to have so much fun today, reading stories and getting mailbox surprises. It's going to be so much fun. Did you hear that? That means that something has just arrived in the Magic Mailbox. Let's find out what it is. Oh, this is such a cute story. Baking day at grandma's. Now I don't go by grandma. I go by Gigi. So I would say it's baking day at Gigi's, but this is such a great book. If you have a copy, go grab it and we can read it together. I can't wait to see what happens when they all bake with grandma today. Baking day at grandma's. Baking Day at Grandma's was written by Annika Denise and illustrated by Christopher Denise, published by Philomel Books. It's Baking Day! It's Baking Day! It's Baking Day at Grandma's! Bundle up! It's time to go out across the drifts of snow! Past the pond so smooth and clear, little cottage drawing near. There's that wonderful sound again. Let's see what's in the magic mailbox. Aw, it's a little stuffed bear. I wonder if this is Grandma Bear or one of the three little bears that are going to help her cook. That's so sweet. It's so soft, too. Well, let's see what happens in the story. Knock, knock, knock on Grandma's door. Hear her pad across the floor. Plant a kiss on Grandma's nose. Cozy fire, warming toes. It's baking day. It's baking day. It's baking day at Grandma's. <laughs> There's that sound again. Let's see what's in the magic mailbox. Do you want to take a guess about what it might be? I think it's going to have something to do with baking. What do you think? Let's find out. Oh, let's see. Looks like we have some broccoli and, oh, a cutting board. A little knife. Oh, and a carrot. <laughs> I don't know what they're going to make. Maybe nothing with these things, but this is fun. You can cut it with the knife and then you have two pieces of the carrot. You could make maybe some vegetable soup or something fun. Let's see what grandma's going to make with her little cubs. Pass out aprons. One, two, three. Grandma reads the recipe. Flour, sugar, butter, eggs. Stand on chairs with tippy legs. Wooden spoon and measuring cup. Mix the batter. Stir it up. Fold it gently in the pan. Lick the spoon because we can. It's baking day. It's baking day. It's baking day at Grandma's. Oh, I just love it when I hear that sound, don't you? That means something else has just arrived in the magic mailbox. Let's see what it is. Oh, looks like a spatula of some sort. Oh, a frying pan. Piece of bread. Oh, can't reach it. Let's see. Another piece of bread. And one more thing. A piece of cheese. Now what can we make with that? I think if we put it all together, we could make a grilled cheese. That would be fun. We make those at Gigi's house a lot. They're so yummy. I don't think that's what grandma's making with her cubs, but I don't know about you. I love grilled cheese and scrambled eggs and pancakes and macaroni and cheese. There's so many fun things to make. In fact, if you watch till the end of the video, you'll get to see some of my little bear cubs making something with Gigi. 
but let's get back to the story now to see what Grandma's making. Hop down from the tippy chair, smell the sweetness in the air, one hot cocoa at each place, frosty window, smiley face. Old time music, soft and sweet, skippy notes and tapping feet, learning songs that grandma sings when the kitchen timer rings. It's baking day, it's baking day, it's baking day at grandma's. Flip the pan and out it pops, cut in squares and frost the tops. Add some sprinkles, wrap each one, tie a ribbon, nearly done. Tasty treats in pretty bags, each one marked with little tags. Coats and boots and hats and gloves, the hugs we know that Grandma loves. It's baking day, it's baking day, it's baking day at Grandma's. Walking home under the moon. Back to visit Grandma soon. The end. Thanks for joining me today to read Baking Day at Grandma's. I bet Grandma was so happy to have her baby cubs come and visit her and bake with her for the day. I know I sure love it when I get to see my grandbabies and visit me and play and dance and bake. It's always so much fun. I hope you get to go to your grandmas and Gigi's and ninnies and nanas or nannies, whatever you call your grandma's house too. Well, thank you again for joining and I hope you have a great day. Don't forget to hit subscribe so you'll always know when one of Gigi's Magic Mailbox videos drops. Thanks for watching till the end. Now, just like I promised, I'll show you three of my grandchildren baking with me. They spent the night, and then the next morning, we made pancakes and scrambled eggs. Here they are, my three little helpers. Here, put a little pepper in. Let Stevie put some pepper oh. in. All right, now Daisy, you put some in. That's okay, let Daisy. There this we go. Is and then we need this. All right. Yep. Now it's my turn. Now it's Ryder's turn. Here, scoot it. There you go. Ryder, you put some pepper in. There we go. <laughs> Good job. Just one little shake, okay? One. There we go. Not too, oh, oh, whoa, whoa, that's too much. Okay, that's good. <laughs> All right, stir it up, Dace. Stevie, can you get the cheese out of the fridge? Oh, the cheese is right there. That's not cheese, that's butter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't lick it, that's yucky. <laughs> Stevie, get the shredded cheese out of the drawer. Okay. All right. Okay. There you go. What? Yeah, we got a cheese. Good job, Ryder. Everybody put one little handful of cheese in, okay? Good job, guys. Oh, Daisy, you get some cheese. <laughs> Don't put any more in. I think it's got plenty. Oh, Stevie's eating some cheese. I don't want to eat some cheese. <laughs> you don't have to. <laughs> All right, let's cook the eggs. Now 
What do you think, Stevie? Oh, we got a thumbs up. What do you think, Days? Oh, <laughs> we got a number one. Oh, and a thumb. All right. Is that yummy? Good job. And a hand. And a hand. <laughs> you like those, Stevie? Good job. Ryder, what about you? 